Hello everyone, and welcome back to the Brugly channel. I'm your host, Brugly, as always. And in this video, I'm gonna be bringing you part 7 of the Backrooms Joke Level series, which of course, is where I go over some of the funniest, craziest, goofiest Backrooms levels submitted to me by you. In this video, I'm gonna go over two joke levels from you all, and two joke levels from the Wikidot. So four total joke levels in this video. Without further ado, let's get right into this craziness, shall we? First up for the video is Level Vibe from the Wikidot. Level Vibe is classified as a class vibe and is chillin', daydreaming, and what the kids would call a mood. <laughs> the level itself is simply the coolest level to ever exist. It physically looks like a world of daydreams, and every daydream that's ever been thought of appears here. Anything can happen. If you want to be a cat and ride a paper airplane through the mountains, uh, sure, go for it. Do you want to live here? No, uh, kind of, yeah. People who get sent to the vibe rooms will be able to explore this beautiful holographic terrain and can ride the ocean waves on the mood beach. And they can explore mountains as well, which just so happen to be erupting with pure nostalgia. <laughs> Dude, like, what? Pretty much this level is a huge, crazy trip where you can just chill out, vibe, relax, and anything can happen. And there won't be a wretch chasing you. There is one base here, and it's for all those who want to chill. And to enter this level, you gotta look into your own mind, and you might find it. Thanks for these specific instructions, dude. I really appreciate it. And to exit, you have to refuse the vibe. That's it. But why would you want to refuse it? Next for the video is from you underscore on Discord, and the level is called the Moai Rooms. This level has a survival difficulty of class dead zone, and you probably shouldn't come here at all unless you want to unalive. The Moya Rooms look very similar to level zero, but instead of an empty yellow wasteland, the whole thing is filled up with Moyai statues. These statues can see every move you make, and if you make any specific sudden or quick movements, you're gonna not make it out of here. Because if you do that, these statues will surround you. Like, every single statue in this level will make this huge circle around you, and they'll repeatedly then dive on top of you until you're flat as a pancake. Cool. Then you'll be turned into one of these statues yourself and join the army. And the only way to safely make it through the level without being absolutely obliterated is to either crawl or rub your entire body in vanilla perfume. Okay. Okay. Oh, this is nice though. If you're wearing a hat when you get attacked and turned into a statue, then your statue will also have a hat. How thoughtful. To enter this level, you have to find a chocolate Moyai statue and eat it. Because I'm sure those are totally common, you know, in the back rooms. And you have to do the same thing to exit. Because apparently, there's going to be a few randomly scattered in this level. But personally, my advice is to avoid this place unless you like getting pummeled by giant statues. Next for the video is the level from the Wikidot called The Back Room. This level has a survival difficulty of 1 and is back room. <laughs> My humor is broken. There are many rooms. Out of all rooms, this is one of them. <laughs> Thanks for that, dude. I appreciate it. As far as the level description, the room itself looks like a large white room with a window, chair, and a fan, as well as a door. Oh, so it's just a normal room. Cool. For bases and outposts, many people have entered the room, and we don't know where they are. There's also an interview section here, and it reads as follows. The interviewer asks, is this a room? And the room man says, yes. And that's, that's it. That's literally it. The entrance to this level is door. And the exit to this level is also door. How does this level have 118 upvotes, dude? What? Lastly, for this incredible masterpiece of a video that is probably the best video I've ever uploaded, is from Dank on Discord, and it's called Level Banana. This level has a survival difficulty of gentle minions. Of course it does. And it's friendly, grulicious, and bellow, which is how minions say hello. The level looks like a huge infinite scape of yellow halls and floors. 
much like level zero, except even more yellow somehow, and there's a constant smell of bananas wafting throughout the halls. On top of that, there's actual bananas on the floor in some places. The only entities here, of course, are minions, except they look slightly different and more gross. They're not cute or nice either, because if you get seen with a banana in your hand, these things will swarm you and like attack you until you give it back. Fun times. And the only outpost here is of course the gentle minions. And to enter, you have to hold a banana on any level and say bellow in a minion's voice three times and you'll just be sitting here. But honestly, I'm trying to avoid an army of these things swarming me, so I think I'm gonna pass on this level. Alright everybody, that was it for the 7th installment of the Joke Level series. I hope you all enjoyed it, thank you for watching until the end. If you are still watching, comment the keyword Gentle Brugly in the comments and I'll throw you a heart because you're a real one for watching till the end and I appreciate it. Thank you all so much for the support of the channel, thank you for everything you do for me. Make sure to check the description for any links you need, Twitter, Discord, my second channel Toogly. Go sub over there, we're almost about to hit 30k and I want to hit 50k by the end of the year, so if you want to help me get there, drop a sub. And also go check out Spoogly, my third channel, if you want to get your weekly fix of cryptids and SCPs and that kind of thing. All my channels are growing. Thank you so much for that. Thank you so much for supporting me. Let me know which level in this video was your favorite. Let me know which one made you laugh, which one was lame, all the above. And also make sure to continue to upload uh, joke levels and fan levels to the submissions tab on Discord. There's tons of levels up over there, and I love reading through all of them. I got many more videos coming involving the fan-made stuff, especially this holiday season. I want to have these specials where it's like, I want to have these writing specials where like there's a spooky contest, and then there's like a Christmas contest and a Thanksgiving contest, and I want to make uh, videos about it all. So, if you're ready for that, go join the Discord, links below, and then write in the submissions tab your level, and someone will review your level, and then they will send it to me if it passes the review. And it's a grand time. Hope y'all are indeed having a great day. And I hope you are looking forward to this wonderful time of year that we're about to go into. I'm so excited for it. I'm just excited to wear hoodies, man. I'm gonna be real. I hope y'all are having a great day. Thank you for watching the video. Thank you for everything you do for me. And I will see you in the next video. Peace!